deciding if an aircraft is able to land in an austere location shouldn't be the top priority when needing a medical facility. Due to the C-130's ability to land on dirt or bare bases, they are an invaluable resource when it comes to moving patients. We can really provide pretty quick transport wherever they need to go, even from the smaller dirt fields, the 130, we can take it in there, pick up whoever needs to be picked up and bring them back here. The hospital actually stabilizes them, um, re-manifests them, and then they go to Germany, the air ambulance, if you will. While the mission of this team can sometimes be the difference of life and death for its patients, the men and women flying the air ambulance truly appreciate their job. It's a good feeling to be able to, you know, get the patients where they need to go so that they can get the proper care that they need. If I can get my patients to laugh, I'm like the happiest person in the world. I want to get you to laugh, I want to get you to smile, the, you know, forget that you're kind of injured for a little while. Another reason for the patients to smile was the flight took less time than anticipated. The C-130 crew and patients arrived two hours ahead of schedule. Got it. Got it. From Bagram Airfield, Afghanistan, I'm Air Force Sergeant Amy Sly.